Hi, Moxie fam. Let's talk about how to add your favorite pages to your new Moxie Life digital notebook. Um, we have a colorful edition and a neutral edition. Um, both work in applications such as GoodNotes, which we'll talk about today, Notability, and Pinly for our Android users. But first, let's do our GoodNotes. Um, so if you have an iPad, this is our preferred method. Um, always save a copy and a backup of your uh, digital downloads in case anything happens. We always recommend that. But let's just um, add our favorite page. So I'm going to start off by adding a page to the behind tab number one. I'm going to add the legal page. I'm just going to click those three dots in the top right hand corner. Press copy page. Um, and then I'm going to go back to page num the tab one. And then I'm you see me circling that upper page where it says I can add a page. And you have the option to copy and paste that page either before the tab, after the tab, or on your last page in your document. I always choose to do it after. It just is a little bit easier. And so I'm going to, again, paste it behind um, this current page so I can have multiple pages behind this particular tab. And you just repeat this process for each page. Um, we always want to copy the original uh, note page template. Do not do not move your original because that will mess with your hyperlinks and we don't want to do any of that and we don't want you to delete the original because um, we want to keep those hyperlinks nice and strong. So you just repeat that uh, process, those three dots, copy your page template, go to your tab, and then add it. Um, and so that's how you can have it. Now if you want to move things around, move pages and your tabs um, after you have them all copied and pasted, click those four dots in the upper left hand corner and you'll get this overview of the thumbnails. And then this way you can click your pages however you like and move them around. Um, say you decide you wanna change your table of contents or what you put behind each tab. This makes it easy to just move those notes around um, without having to like redo things. So, and if you um, wanna delete um, a particular page, you can also do that as well um, by using the select tool. But if you have any questions about good notes, um, go ahead and drop them in the comments below. Our next application is Notability. This is also available for iPad users. Again, we recommend saving your application in your favorite cloud service um, as a backup. Now, uh, to add a page to Notability, to add your favorite page template behind it, um, behind your favorite tabs, go to your page note paper template um, I'm going to use the Cornell blank. I'm going to click that page button at the top uh, right hand corner and um, I'm going to click those three dots on the page that's currently selected and I'm going to press copy and then I'm going to click the tab that I want it behind. So I want it behind tab number one. Then I'm going to click those three dots on tab number one and press paste. You always want to copy the original um, you do not want to move the original. You always want to copy and paste because we do not want to delete the original page. Um, we want to make sure we keep those um, because we don't want to mess with the hyperlinks or delete them by accident. So it's real simple. You just honestly pull up that little sidebar. It's really simple. Click the three dots, copy, and then paste it behind whatever page or tab that you want it. Um, and if you need to delete, you can always click those three dots and click the delete button as well and if you want to move your pages around all you have to do is move it up and down and if you have any questions um, definitely let us know in the comments below our next application is pinly this is for our android users again make sure you save your document so you always have a backup to your favorite cloud service um, and we're going to talk about how to add those note paper templates behind your favorite dividers. So um, you're going to go to the note paper template, go to your preferred note paper that you want to copy. I'm going to use the monthly. Click those four dots in the upper left hand corner. Click edit and I'm going to click that monthly spread again and then I'm going to click those two like paper like things next to the trash button in the upper um, right hand corner and I'm going to press copy and you'll see where it's at one page copy and then I'm going to press um, paste after. So I selected the tab, the yellow uh, tab, and I'm going to paste it after and I'm going to again hold it down again and press paste after the page. So I have multiple 
copies of it. Do not, do not, do not um, move your original file. We always recommend copying it so nothing happens to your hyperlinks and you don't lose pages. I'm gonna repeat that process again. Um, I copied the Kanban board um, and I'm gonna paste it after tab number two and paste a few more. And that is really it, how I go about um, copying and pasting. Now, if I want to move things around, um, I can also move pages around really seamless in this um, process. I just click the template and then I have a selection to move it. I can move uh, to select it to move it before the tab. And um, that's also how I would move pages around. But if you have any questions, definitely let us know in the comments below. Have a great day.